Here is a streamlined vehicle called the Cigar of Records. But you are not allowed to smoke inside because <laughs> uh, clear. Um, it was always the problem to get in this very narrow space, but it's even uh, 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 difficult uh, to get out again because high speed and very narrow. And um, look at here, at these um, uh, 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 wheels, they are only as, um, as a support. And if you are on speed, uh, they go inside. Uh, three bathing tubs are put together to make this vehicle. Ha, very wonderful from the company of NSU, uh, uh, the cigar of records. Wow. Wow. Smoking. Hello, dear visitor from all over the world. We are here in the Erfinderzeiten Museum in Schramberg. My name is Hemmerle and I'm your guide in this wonderful museum full of beautiful cars and, and, and motorcycles and uh, bicycles and uh, tuft tuft tek tek bak tak bak bak tak bak. <laughs> this for example, is the most beautiful car in the world, as I think. It's the Isabella Borgwart. <laughs> Look at this. Uh, uh, but how to come to Schramberg? Um, it's easy. If you come from Stuttgart or Munich, you have uh, only um, uh, take um, the, the street uh, or the autobahn uh, to here. And from Rottweil, you have to go um, uh, at the right side, and, and, and then you, <laughs> then you are in uh, Schramberg. Let us show you the wonderful exhibition in the Erfinderzeit Museum. Come, come. <laughs> is a tangerine dream, a three-wheel vehicle, and it's a world record automobile. It was in 1979, and there was a, a big tournament at Hockenheim. It's in the near. And the family Weber from Oberndorf and the Neckar, it's uh, also in the near, um, uh, invented this wonderful special car. And um, it goes um, with one liter, one liter uh, gasoline, uh, 824 kilometers. And, um, and that's about, um, in miles, um, that's, um, uh, 824, you have, this, um, um, uh, the, the 824, 600, that's a very long distance. Uh, well done, family Weber from Oberndorf. And this is the door of the Urbanix, uh, uh, something like a yellow cap, uh, invented in 1972 from Le Poix, uh, inventor um, from uh, Baden-Baden. It's, it's in the near. <laughs> and here have you everything what you, what you need. Uh, a a seatbelt, 1972, you only have to make a, a knot and you are absolutely safe. Uh, a steering wheel, and here all these instruments. Um, it goes with electro and hybrid and all these. And uh, here is um, the, the tournament, uh, the, the, the revolutions um, the per minutes. Here is the, uh, the speed, uh, here is um, the time, here is uh, the temperature, <laughs> everything um, wonderful. And, and no no air condition, no, but the uh, door is open. And um, here, 9.8, um, that means this solitaire only one time built is um, only uh, driven uh, in the reverse uh, 200 meter. It's a pity. This is the Ford Taunus of 1950. 
50. Uh, uh, Taunus is a forest uh, in, in the near. Um, uh, he is the handyman, but this is the captain, the Opel Kapitän, a dream car of the 50 years, uh, uh, with curves and, and uh, everything you have to, with an antenna and all, all, all these um, things. Uh, if you have this car, you have leadership as a captain <laughs> with, with everything you need, and the antenna and, uh, and for, for the head, uh, the uh, space and um, a place for the wobbling dex hound, the so-called wackeldackel. are two uh, bicycles um, uh, not up and one from uh, Ladenburg. Ladenburg is, um, is in the near and, um, and uh, what, what you have to do when you make uh, what you wanted to make a, a, a motor uh, bike you uh, buy two bicycles and then you go in the store and uh, buy another engines too. Here this not um, a bottle um, and no fan. This is the auxiliary engine and you can um, uh, do it under on uh, the front of the wheel and uh, and then whirr, whirr, <laughs> uh, yes um, um, that's the way the German built motorcycles after the World War II. Mercedes-Benz 300, a symbol of the uprising nation of Germany after World War II, a symbol. Uh, and uh, here, this window wiper uh, 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 inside the cancers of uh, um, uh, Germany of the 50s and 60s. Here's uh, Konrad Adenauer um, uh, and uh, Ludwig Erhard. And uh, uh, this, uh, this driver, I do not actually know who this is, maybe Mr. Lehmann or Mr. Miller, or it <laughs> doesn't matter to us. A wonderful car here in Erfinderzeiten. Ooh, 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 yeah. ooh, 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 hey. is a revolutionary car, the NSU Ro 18, NSU von Neckarsulm, it's, um, it's in the near. It was the car of the rear 1967 because of a revolution. Uh, uh, the engine here, under this, um, um, uh, moment please, uh, uh, under this bonnet, there is uh, the Wankel engine. It's no, um, it's no um, uh, uh, reciprocating piston technology. Spomp, sip, spomp, sip, spomp, sip. It's the Wankel engine. Rizzi, rizzi, rizzi. It was a pity after two years of production they stopped it uh, because some problem there uh, with um, the engine. Uh, but uh, the technology of Wankel comes back um, uh, when um, uh, with um, the hydrogen technology when they get power out of hydrogen. It uh, could take a little time more, but uh, the future.